We were the first vegetarian accredited hotel in New Zealand. That's been a great journey for us in terms of a plant-based philosophy. So the dish today, what I've tried to focus on is fully plant-based and gluten-free so that it ticks the boxes for a few uh, diets. So we, we're going to prepare a peas falafel with a courgette salad. It's not going to be traditional falafel wherein it's deep fried, it's going to be um, sort of pan fried, shallow fried. First thing first, we, we're going to dehydrate some of these red pepper. So the next thing is the peas falafel. So what we've got here is uh, some fresh frozen peas, gluten free falafel, equal parts of the falafel mix, a bit of salt there. The idea is to make uh, 25 gram little even sized patties. This has to cook uh, slow and long and it sort of gently cooks. So we'll let it cook on one side without sort of moving it for about five to six minutes on one side. Then we turn it and cook it on the other side for again uh, five to six minutes. So now is where we prepare our courgette salad. For this uh, recipe, we're not gonna cook the courgette because we're gonna keep it a raw salad. What I've here is the uh, roasted peppers. What we're gonna do is add it, we add in a little bit of seasoning. So here is some leeks, which we made some uh, rounds out of. So we're gonna blanch the leeks. Slightly season it. So one of the other garnishes that we're gonna use is a Cavallo Nero. The same principle of blanching, in goes and out it comes. So the blanched uh, Cavallo Nero, just a bit of avocado olive oil. So one of the first things that goes on the base of the plate is the red pepper garlic lemon hummus. A generous dab of the red pepper sauce. And then we're gonna angle these. So then we've got the yellow pepper and courgette salad. So onto the center of the plate. Keep some of the leek rings, beetroot relish, and then the cavallo nero, dehydrated red pepper. And to just finish it all, uh, we've got here some sumac powder, just around it, and that is the finished dish. Um, the idea behind it is, um, to have local, seasonal, plant-based products and to have f and offerings around it. Plants are considered nutrient-dense and to work around it is challenging but again rewarding at the same time. As people are getting more and more aware of uh, their bodies and their health products, so people want to have a lot more plant-based uh, products as a part of their uh, meals. For the entree, we've got macadamia cheese with poached baby vegetables and the spinach coconut uh, cannelloni. These are the two main um, or the, the most popular entrees that we have on our plant-based. And then for the main course, we've got the organic uh, tofu and pea stuffed potato and the mushroom tartlet. Uh, these two are wildly popular uh, with the diners. 